fact, I would say the chance of a bunch of my soldiers dying from that mission is around about zero. Got another extract VIP, a rescue VIP. Is this at extremely light yet? This is still very light. Maybe it's going to be very light forever. Maybe we should just launch it now. Yeah. Do I have a strategy for managing vigilance? Uh, create as much of it as I can. It's not something that you really have to manage. The only exception is I don't really want to create a ton of it right at the start of a region generating missions because the missions that you can get while vigilance is low are quite valuable. So I don't take the like get advent attention missions right at the start of my time in a region. But once I'm like midway through a region's lifespan, I'll take a get advent attention mission. Move in and destroy the target. We're in concealment. In control is now hosting you. Thanks, in control. Losing control of the situation. Uh, so I wanted to find a rooftop for the sharpshooters, but I don't think we're going to. We have a new follower. Epson987 is registered with Advent Skynet. Thanks for the follow, Epson. Welcome to the stream, and thanks a lot for the support. Uh, Moving to designated coordinates. Hostiles making the rounds. Yeah, we are not getting to a rooftop, I don't think. So if we have a shinobi, we do not have a shinobi, right? Just going to be killing some stuff. a lot of stuff. I'm gonna have like another three follower clips or so probably. And then I'm also gonna get some more clips for Understood. other on. events. I was thinking it would be nice to have clips for when people hit point thresholds in the channel. That could be sort of fun. I don't want to spam them too bad, but a little bit of recognition. On the move. So these guys standing next to a car, which goes boom, are certainly interesting. I've got lots of rockets. I also have quite good overwatches. I've got a guardian sharpshooter. I have a specialist with cool under pressure. I could like hit the overwatch button on a couple of guys and shoot a rocket this turn. We do have time though. Hmm. If these guys patrol away, then we can just isolate a pot of three. Pulling the drone as well is fine by me because it will just run toward us and we can kill it with a shotgun. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think I can move here and just be in flamethrower range. Moving to designated coordinates. Yup. Cool. I'm gonna hit Overwatch on this sharpshooter with Guardian. Scanning. Yeah, let's hit Overwatch with the Specialist, too. I'm gonna Fortify Technical just to be safe. So the purpose of Fortifying the Technical is that if the pod that's over by the Explodey car decides to patrol in on Yellow Alert, they're not gonna be able to do anything, hopefully. 
All right, that was the problem with setting these guys on Overwatch. Uh, killing the guy who had two hit points and was on fire is not really a particularly valuable thing to do. Guardian Sharpshooter uh, doing stupid things, though. Thank you, Guardian Sharpshooter, for breaking the entirety of the early game for me. Oh, he's still shooting. Did he miss? It's still moving. You're fired, dude. I should have rapid targeted this before the overwatching started. Rapid targeting does not break concealment. And would have given another 10% chance to hit. Guess it all turned out okay in the end though. So I want to chuck evac over here. Requesting immediate evac. I might change where that is later, but having it around. I can just sharpshooter here, sharpshooter here, get vision of the relay with another soldier. Kill it and then leave maybe without fighting the last pot on the map. This is a very light, so probably there's another pot of three or something, something like that. Mostly have. I think this is fine. We don't have to wait. I'm thinking about a rocket on these guys, and then I have sharpshooters. <laughs> Squad wipe seems a little bit confused. Oh man. Oh man, we hit the civilians. That's really too bad. That's that's just a shame. Oh. Didn't mean to do that. <clears throat> Kill confirmed. The guy's an actual madman. I'm gonna move away from. I'm gonna move away from technicals mid game. Sharpshooters are very strong throughout the entire campaign. I'm trying to find a way to make my technicals scale okay through mid game, but it's been difficult to work anything out. This is probably the weakest that my sharpshooters will be in the campaign. I enjoyed that we crit the civilians just like to make sure. Because you wouldn't want to to, to, to not crit them, you know? What if they stayed alive? Actually, that guy lived through a rocket crit. I thought, what? I thought we killed him. Good shooting. X-ray neutralized. Burn chance on the yeah. The technical gets increasing burn chance as the campaign goes on and you upgrade to better gauntlets. I think it's 40% to 70%, somewhere like that. I'm pretty sure I'm wrong on the second number, but that's like the vicinity. Here I come. Confirmed. Yeah, it's based on which gauntlet you have. 
Overwatch. Moving to Overwatch. Scan the repeat. Overwatch. Fire's getting close here! I'd love a tile where I was in cover and could see the relay. I guess technically I'm in cover here. As long as as long as I need to take cover from my own squad. Yeah, that's a vanilla code bug. It's because they are stepping out, but then they're not stepping back in again. They're doing only half of the hokey pokey. Good to go. Covering now. I wanted to move up here, but maybe it's too scary this turn. I'll try to remember to do that next turn before I move all of my other guys. Okay. We can fight these or we can ignore them. Shoot the relay a couple more times and leave. They're like standing. This is Firebrand. It's time to go. I just walk forward. Not quite. It's hard not to shoot that rocket. They are doing only the hokey and not doing the pokey. Is that like. Is that a sex joke? For people from like Puritan England? What is. What is the etymology of hokey pokey? Let's do this! I feel like there's zero percent chance that there has not been some point in history where that's been a euphemism for sex. Let's keep it scored. Low on ammo. Yeah, sticky bun, how's it going? So Sectoid will presumably try to mind spin someone, is that what the ability is called? Such a threatening ability. I spent a lot of time learning about it so much that I can almost remember what it's called. I have Revival Protocol which hard counters that, I'm on it. if it even does anything to begin with. Small intel cache. We're gonna try to hack a small intel cache on the way out of this mission. Come on, focus. You should miss him for ice cream. They don't have hokey pokey ice cream in America. Something I'm, you know, you'd think that I'd get over that after, I don't know, maybe 12 years living in the country, but no. Still pretty pissed off. Welcome to the channel, Sticky Bun. That's awesome. You been checking out my YouTube stuff or just on Twitch? On the move. Locked and loaded. Solid quote game, guys. Covering now. Got it covered. On Overwatch. Rolling. Scanning. Rock. I already forgot that we killed the loot. That's how little I care about it. 
Well, welcome, Sticky Fun. Check out my tutorials on YouTube, and I have some of my 1.0 campaign up there as well. If you're looking for more of my stuff. I'm a bully to my viewers? No. I just express love in a very awkward way. It's just because of... It's because of uh, my childhood or something. I was emotionally stunted. In fairness, there is, I feel, some lighthearted bullying going both ways in this channel. <laughs> you guys are hardly always nice to me. You guys are all right. I'm pretty sure I tell you guys I like you all the time. I try to balance it out. You know, you need like three good things for every criticism, right? To leave people feeling like you've treated them fairly. Because humans are very, very uh, lopsided in how they perceive things that happen to them or something. I don't know. So if I say you guys are all right, you guys are all right, you guys are all right, you guys are sort of lame. Probably that leaves you feeling about the same as you were at the start. Whatever you say, I'm all over it. I'm tired of waiting around. I'm the drunk, abusive teacher who always wanted but never had. One of my favorite professors in college showed up in class one day with a cold. So like, okay, he has a cold, sure. But his approach to having a cold was to bring a bottle of Dayquil and drink it from the bottle during the lecture, which I thought was, <laughs> I thought was an interesting approach to lecturing with a cold. I think the best spam on this channel right now is actually a Bradford spam. Because the Bradford spam is the only one that actually like breaks my screen as I'm streaming. If you guys were uh, were a smarter chat, I'm sure you would have worked that out by now. Boom! Oh. Gosh. Gosh. That's also a pretty interesting approach to being sick. Please don't kill me, <laughs> you guys. Another decent looking assault. Yeah, pretty decent assault. Low aim, but you make up for that by standing next to things and killing them with your shotgun. 
overall pretty okay. We're at 92 intel. So... Oh my. Um... So we can cancel this. Ah! Can sell another 25 supply worth of stuff. Build a GTS. Get this going, build a lab. And then the next thing that we build can be resistance communications because we have resistance contacts here. Let's go to the black market, sell 25 supply worth of things. Pick up our resistance contact. I have five suppressors. It's just sort of how we roll. I might sell some. Seems like a bad idea. Can't possibly be right. Alright, so for those of you who don't know, if you have zero supply at the end of the month, you don't have to pay maintenance, so that's why I'm doing this like very specific micromanaging of my supply. It's all so that I get 10 more supply than I would have otherwise. I was going to scan here right now to get Liberation 2 with a better timer on it. Yeah, let's do that first and then pick... Oh, but I have to contact the region. Let's do this. Liberation 2. Hopefully we'll just get lucky, right? We'll just get lucky. Get it with like six days without even trying. Hybrid mats is done. We can now render an Illyrium core for enough Illyrium for laser weapons. I had assumed you'd make that research a priority, Commander. I'll notify you as soon as the report is available. I got nine gops done that month. With zero failed as well. That's really good. Is this liberation? Got another jailbreak. Flex rumble crunch. I keep mech troopers alive and enemy within. You've come to the right place to ask, ask that question. So mech troopers and enemy within have a very unique power curve. They're actually very weak exactly when you regularly get them in a campaign. Like July and August with mech one suits is just not great. They'll die pretty easily. Their damage is good, but they're going to die a lot. So the way that I play with mechs to get campaigns with like six mechs in one team sometimes, like absolutely break tactical in Long War 1, is I play France and I just rush straight to mechs. And you can get aim modules for your Stingray Interceptors to beat the air game because um, <sighs> Alien Cybernetics, is that what it's called? Bio-Cybernetics? is a prereq for floater autopsy, which gives aim modules. So you do that, you get super early mechs, and then you just sort of snowball off that. If you have three mechs with flamethrowers, you're going to have enough to kill everything before it can shoot at you anyway. So you stop having to worry about them having lower amounts of hit points. Also, marauders are really good. Marauders get quite a lot of survivability. Wattis, no. You were the chosen one. Uh catch you around, Quatis. So I've got a nanoscale now, which 
could be nice on this gunner with the worst defensive stats in the world. So I don't really want to fight stuff on this mission, but we're loading out with the assumption that we're going to end up fighting stuff. Hopefully we can get it down to extremely light, be a little bit lucky if we can. Yes, the 15 hack gunner. Truly living the dream. Advent scopes. It's a little bit unfortunate. Let's contact the Western US. Malaise has registered with Advent Skynet. Thanks for the follow, Malaise. Welcome to the stream, and I really appreciate the support. immediately, Commander. I'll contact you when I have a full report available. You don't want to know what Bradford has been up to. Sometimes it's important to just recognize when a question isn't actually worth asking. Got a 200% infiltration on this guy. Do it. We're moving in for an emergency extraction of a VIP working for the resistance. The spokesman provided the coordinates, but the rest is up to us. Locate the VIP and escort them out of the area safely. <laughs> Goes without saying, but don't leave any hostiles standing. Oh, Bradford. You sly old dog, you. Tech order so far, resistance comms, basic research, hybrid materials, render Illyrium core laser is what I've done this campaign. So I don't think that getting lasers in April is like that important, especially if you're low economy, which I have been. I haven't gotten super rich in any way off any of the early missions. So it's gonna be difficult to afford laser weapons. And it's just not that important. As long as you lean on your technicals, you can kill stuff in April just fine. Um, so that's why I went for basic research because I didn't get anything in the first two or 